I'm going to do a quick overview of how you use the Nimbus. When you receive a Nimbus, you'll have the main dome, you'll have a template for cutting out backgrounds, and you'll have a carry bag that holds everything together. The Nimbus excels at small product photography. It's a simple dome, it's lightweight, it's small, it's very durable, and it is very simple to use. We've come up with this band system that allows you to use almost any phone that has a camera. Here's how you use it. First, select something you'd like to photograph, then line it up with the dome. Then locate the camera on your phone. Doesn't matter if it's in the corner or in the middle. The Nimbus will hold both types. Just lift the band and line up. Then you can move the dome around to center the picture just as you like it. Then set the exposure and take the picture by just touching and snapping the picture. And that's all there is to it. One of the more interesting things we're going to be doing to help you get the most out of the Nimbus is that they're going to produce a number of pre-downloadable backgrounds that you can take with you when you shoot product photography. When you go to the website, you'll be able to download a background and it'll print like this on your home printer. Then you just cut it out and you're ready to go. The backgrounds fit just right for the Nimbus. Most likely you're going to want to produce your own backgrounds. And included with the Nimbus is this clear template that allows you to move around and get the exact where you would like your background to be. And then you just take a pen scribe a line and then cut it out. We're going to take a picture of this brooch with one of our printed backgrounds. Just line it up. And place the dome over the item. You can zoom up and down to get just the framing you'd like. Take the picture. I'd like to show you just how good the pictures can be with an iPhone 4S and the Nimbus. I've opened the watch up to see the movement inside, uh, placing it on a white piece of paper. I'm going to set the Nimbus down, touch to focus, take the picture. I think you'll be amazed at the quality that you can get. If you use Apple products, they have photo streaming so that whatever is taken on the camera, on the phone, is automatically transferred to your computer or to your iPad. This makes it very easy to do any edits or adjustments that you need to do for color balance or to straighten your picture up or to sharpen it up just a little bit. Just a few seconds ago, I took the picture of the watch. And here it is in our my photo stream. So I'll touch it. There it is. Now I use a program called Snapseed. There are lots of uh, editing programs for the iPad, but I find that Snapseed is just really excellent and fun to use. I've opened the photo in Snapseed. And first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and just rotate it so that I have a little bit better look to it. Also, I noticed that it's not quite straight, so I'm just going to rotate 
slightly until I get just the right alignment. Okay, it's done. Hit save. And in just a matter of seconds, you've gone from taking the picture to having an absolutely excellent product photograph that you can use to email or actually even use in small print. There are all sorts of apps available that you can use with the Nimbus. Uh, a good example is this one called Softbox Pro, and it lets you choose what type of background you'd like. Uh, you can go, you know, a purple, a green, doesn't matter. We're going to try a dark blue. Then you go ahead and just set it, and then you're actually using the iPad itself as the background for your jewelry. Place the Nimbus on top, press to focus, and take the picture. Now when you do backlighted photographs, you sometimes have to add light to get the perfect exposure. You can find at most hardware stores all sorts of interesting uh, little LED lights that have really good color balance. Uh, this one is by Otlight and it's a pocketable, it fits in the case, and you can use it to just move around until you get just the exposure that you like, like that. Now, the Nimbus does not come with these lights. These are things you need to pick up yourself because there's so many varied types. Um, it's best that you choose which ones you like the best. You can also use the iPad in a different way. You don't need to stick with static backgrounds. Uh, what I've done is I've produced a small little clip of just puffy clouds and uh, put it in a video. And now I'm going to actually place the jewelry right on top of the iPad and uh, go ahead and take this short video clip. Now, you can use this type of video clip in websites um, because you actually introduce motion behind the item you're photographing. It's something new and something kind of unique to try. I hope you found this video interesting and informative. And I further hope that you can see that the Nimbus is a unique product that makes photographing with your cell phone fun and productive. Thanks for watching.